Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how to fix the keys of your key lab, whether it's 25, 61 or whatever, I'm pretty sure uh, it would be the same thing. Uh, now I've never done this before, I didn't know I was going to post this, uh, I disassembled the keyboard, the this one right here, key lab 25, uh, you probably see I have a 61 in the background. I upgraded to the to more keys i disassemble and then i realized oh maybe i should post this because i noticed I, I there was no video on youtube on how to do this and i decided to try and it, it was really easy i haven't again I, i'd never done anything like this before so all you need is um, a screwdriver like this and super glue I just went to walmart and i bought that for two bucks and i fixed it i'm gonna show you right now how i did it I'm going to show you what I found. Um, those of you that have not, that never done this before, this be very helpful. So of course, the first thing you want to do is remove um, the panel. There's a bunch of screws. Remove all of them. Also, these ones right here. Uh, let me show you all of them. The ones around it and the ones in the middle. They have to all go. Um, and so what I found is right here, if you can see, this is how the keys work. <laughs> it's the first time for me. So see how that one is broken? This one right here, that little black thing, it's staying and it's holding the key in place. Whereas that one is broken, as you can see. And so, because it's broken, it doesn't hold the key in place. It just moves all over the place. So that's the reason for the key not staying in place and it's kind of moving all over the place. Same thing was with what's happening to this one. This one, it broke right there. And so, and the piece is right here. So what I'm going to do, I'm probably going to super glue it. And... I'll uh, post a progress of that in a minute. Okay, guys. I glued a little piece in there. And let's just wait until it gets a little bit more, um, I don't know, hard. All right, just took, taking this off. And there it is, right there. The piece that broke off, almost the exact same thing, right there. So it's just a matter of gluing it the same place as the other one. All right, guys, I've glued this one as well. So just let's wait a little bit till it gets it sticks and then I'll show you yeah next thing okay I put the first key and it's a little bit like this because I need to put a little spring in here as you can see that's something that I uh, you should probably remove um, before uh, anything else before you remove the key so I'm going to put that spring back now. Okay. There it is right here. That's the broken key. Not broken anymore. I'll take care of that one. I'll just show you what I do just for this one. It's kind of hard with one hand. But basically, there's a hole right there. it through the hole and then ta -da! it's fixed so I actually I accidentally unplugged this thing <laughs> um, and I put it back uh, I plugged it back in but I wasn't sure uh, if it was gonna work so before putting everything back together I connected it to my computer and 
works. So I plugged it in right. All right, time to put everything back together. Yay! I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe.